I would say to young actors, do get as much experience as you can while it's your hobby. Um, so do all the community theatre and all the high school stuff you can. And if you audition for a show when you're at high school and you don't get it, don't just don't just walk away. Do something in a different department because that's what I regret. I didn't do anything about sound or lighting or crew I, I, or, or, or the orchestra. And I would be much better if I had a more of a knowledge of everyone else's job in the theatre. Uh, perseverance. Just perseverance. Uh, that's the big word. Big to be present, like to really be present. Like, you know, there are some nights that I'm out on stage and, you know, I may have heard some news of what's going on in the world at the moment and I'm going out there and I have to have this cheer and then there's a little bit of anxiety so then I'm sweating and I have to realize like, okay, this is going on right here but I still have to be here and I have, but that's, that's the, the visceral thing about it and the greatness of the duality of acting, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, okay, I'm William at this moment, but that light is flickering, and that person right there is coughing, and somebody's doing it, and you still gotta stay within this kind of, you have to be ever-present, and I like that. So, I think for me it's mostly about just staying in the presence of what's going on around me at all times. Like, because anything can happen, and that, but that's the great thing about being an actor, is let that feed you, let, the, let all these responses, let the hair standing up on the back of your neck be the thing that you, 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 you clock into and remember and, and let it feed, feed the audience because that's what you're there to do. You're there to serve them a meal. You know, you're there to feed them. You're there to, to give them what they want and, um, or what they didn't know they wanted. And yeah, you just provide, you just provide the, the uh, entree for them. Do, uh, do the best work you can. Be kind to everyone. Um, get roped into a show that you're super proud of and that uh, work with an incredible creative team, have an amazing director. It's so funny, whenever, whenever young actors, like training actors, ask me for advice or um, guidance, my answer usually is to recommend a book. And it's a book um, called Letters to a Young Poet by Raina Maria Rilke, who is a, 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 an amazing poet. I can't remember what, what century but it's these book of letters that were collected between him and this young um, poet that was asking, how do I be a writer? How do I be a poet? How do I be an artist? And Rilke's responses are like food for artists. It's, um, it's, so, um, it's so stunning. So I would, I would recommend Letters to a Young Poet to any aspiring actor. Just be as unique as you can. Stand out, stand out from the crowd. Just stand out. Don't follow any rules. Break every freaking rule there is to break. Break every rule and stand out. That's what you do. If, it's, if there's anything else in life that you would like to do, do it. If being in the theater isn't a life or death choice for you, don't go anywhere near it.